Good morning, good afternoon, good evening guys wherever you are on this beautiful world. Whenever you're watching this video, don't worry, be happy. For the newcomers, my name is Didi Tayutu. Yes, welcome to the Bitcoin Family YouTube channel. Um, let's talk a short time about Bitcoin charts. Yes, a TA video, short one, because it's Saturday, I don't have too much time and you can hear the waves and all those birds flying around. Yes, I need to go to the sea to have a swim, to zoom out of the charts, because the charts are not like showing me something I really like in the morning when I'm drinking coffee. But let's just have a look and see what is happening to Bitcoin this morning again. And bam! How high too high? No, no. How low is too low? Welcome to Orox. This is my Orox YouTube setup. Like you see here on the top, YouTube video. I have a really cool chart setup now. This is my beautiful chart over there. I can see over here with uh, why because I put on a widget. I can see um, the order book. If I go a little bit down in the YouTube setup, I can see my market overview. I can see the depth chart. I can see that a lot of people are buying Bitcoin and selling Bitcoin. The thing that is worrying me now again is this red bam dump. Why are people dumping Bitcoin every time it's going up? And I'm drinking coffee. I want to drink my coffee in peace. Those beautiful legs on the back, that's my wife. Yes, <laughs> that was the extra in this video. They want you to stand there. <laughs> then I don't worry and be happy when I see those legs. Um, but guys, the bottom of course last time was 28,800 we are now finding support around 30,200 um, it's low it's low I don't I don't know why they try to dump it but um, let's see how the Bam Bam did it in this market yes let's see we have a short over there and that short we could have taken this is the 30 minute chart guys I'm, I'm trying to just show you all the opportunities in all the time frames. This 30 minute chart said a short flag over there. It said a closing down below the yellow stepping line over there. It said the bam bam crossing over there. It said, I'm going to make this a little bit bigger so you can see it. A red dot over there and the blue and yellow started and the red line was on top. So that was a, a like triple confirmation but even more because the red line also was on top so that was another confirmation um, which would have made you take that short and that short would have given you at the moment let's say we get in late we would now be around a 3.3 percent that's enough for the day you know we only need to make two percent a day and that like 265 days a year and then we can convert two thousand dollars maybe into a million if we compound the profits but that's another story now in the bear market i know you don't have those don't worry happy feelings <laughs> you're looking at the charts like oh my god i'm losing again and um, i made another video yesterday i put it online that morning this morning if you want to handle all those emotions during those tradings and those dumps watch that video please please do um, and also give this video already now a thumbs up because my wife was in it with the naked legs and i'm talking a lot about this beautiful charts again um so if it is up to trading it is beautiful because there's a lot of short and longs on the charts let's take a look at the one hour how that one is performing look that one gave as well a short flag over there so that could have been a good trade as well let's take a look at the four hour because you know that i love to trade the four hour chart and the four hour chart was a really cool chart to trade because this long over there that would have been a perfect trade because we closed above the stepping line over there we didn't close down below it so we stayed in it till there so that would have been a beautiful trade of yeah like six percent and then that short started on the four hour and that short we would have taken over here and that short we would still be in and that short would now be around up okay also seven percent again so beautiful how that works and um, in this beautiful part you can also go to the bottom even more you know and you can put more charts in there um, if you want to open them up you just click 
bam, open them up, and then you see again that beautiful chart I shared with you yesterday, um, where we are finding support here at that 1.618 level. There is some documentaries about the numbers of Fibonacci retracement and how they come back in everything in life. I'm going to watch that one again because it's very, very interesting to see that Bitcoin is moving again to that beautiful blue line of 1.68. We should be holding support over there. If we don't hold support, um, bam, we will see this happening, guys. Yes, wow, wow, Didi is really on, 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 on roll. It's really going okay today. No failures nothing beautiful um, this is the chart I, sh I shared with you many times this is the day chart every candle is a day I told you we are dumping every time around the 25th of the last seven months and again that happened on the 25th does it have to do with the moon does it have to do with the period all of the women in my house I don't know what it is but we dump on the 25th every time it's terrible um, what are we going to do now that is the question are we going to go up in the zigzag formation above that green line and then test that again and then try to break the 200 day moving average which is a very important line to break and then not break it and then bam pull back here to that area uh, on the 25th again a dump um, I didn't draw so you don't know what I'm talking about of course so this one I'm talking about we went up now we come down we go up we go and test that line we try to break the 200 and bam again a dump you know to then at that moment maybe 32,000 again which then again is a dump around the 25th 6th 7th of July or are we just not huddling this holding this line and we break it down we come back we retest that line we go lower and again try to come up and then dump to that 24k that everybody is um, expecting on the 25th of july so i expect a lot of volatility in between this day today and the 25th of july but let's see let's see what is going to happen guys we don't we can't predict the future we can only trade the charts and if you want to trade the charts we use the bam bam indicator and we use um, the tiktok indicator for that and if you want to use them as well then please go to the bitcoinfamily.com you will find all the information over there how you can get access on oryx to these indicators and how you can buy the upgraded versions as well very soon so there's a lot of information on the bitcoinfamily.com go there and if you want to trade these charts on bybit because this is the order book of bybit then please sign up to bybit using our referral link because then you get a huge bonus a bonus up to three thousand us dollar at the moment and yes we earn some fees and yes we use those fees to help poor people all over the world was that everything for today I think that was everything for today. Oh no, I have one more really cool chart I want to show you because that one is also very important. And that is BAM. This one, that is the last thing of today, guys. If you look at this chart, I'm going to put my face over there. Um, this one is made by Glassnode. Uh, and together with Willy Who, you know that Willy Who, Who, Willy Who? Yeah, the Willy Who, I know Willy Who. He create this chart together with Glassnode. And in this chart, you can see the stable coin supply ratio SSR oscillator this means that the yellow line that's the stable coin supply the gray line that is the the Bitcoin price guys and if you now look at that yellow line every time the yellow line makes a low over there for example and then goes up means that US dollar teeter are going into the market to buy Bitcoin probably and that's why the Bitcoin price also rises, you see? Then here there's a local low, the Bitcoin price dumps, and then we go up again. There is a low, people start to buy, people start to move, US dollar theaters to exchanges and all that stuff. Bitcoin price is going up again. Then there is a low after the dump, and then people start to move their US dollar teeter and other stable coins again. And that means that people start to buy the Bitcoins again, which again should mean that the Bitcoin price should be going up again. So really cool chart. Um, really like it. If you want to know more about these charts, go to Glassnode. No, I'm not being too paid to, to promote Glassnode. I don't have an affiliate link, but you can go there. You will find the information about the stable coin supply ratio and many other stuff that has to do with trading. Bam, my beautiful face or ugly face, whatever you like about or don't like about it. Don't worry, be happy. I'm not worrying, I'm happy. Um, yes, sometimes you freak out because of the charts. I, after, being in this industry since 2013 already experienced this 
every time again and I'm still experiencing this but only on the 20 to 30 percent that I'm trading with the 70 percent I believe in the long-term holding but still for me it's a game I want to win the game I want to win the trade I don't want to lose the trade I want to have confirmations of what I'm doing and that is right and I know that you have the feeling as well but if you can't handle those emotions or handle those emotions whatever English you prefer then please go to the video I already created this morning watch that one because there I talk you through how you could handle those emotions. Thanks for watching. I hope you really enjoyed the video. If you did enjoy the video, give it a thumbs up, share with your friends and family, subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell, and please leave a comment. And especially about the beautiful long legs of my wife. Thanks for watching and see you tomorrow again, guys. Bye. How soon is too soon?